We are going to make a low-fat morning latte. It's a good thing to invest in, oh, something as simple as this. This is a Bialetta. I love Bialetti um, coffee maker. It makes really good drip coffee. At home, this really works fantastically. And it's a, a very cute little gadget. Um, I love it. You put, there's a little steam valve here on the, on the um, outside. Put water into, and I use, I use uh, bottled water at my house. You don't have to, but I, I do. And then um, right below the valve, right below this little valve, then you put your uh, little coffee holder right in here. And oh, this is the best. You must use the Antica Tostatura Triestina coffee. This is my favorite coffee. I learned about this at my favorite little coffee shop up on the Upper East Side called Via Quadrono. And this is what they use all the time. And this is Cafe uh, Macinata uh, Mocha. And it's fine ground. And you just fill this little strainer gadget that fits inside your Bialetti and um, put it in here. Don't, you don't have to pack it down like a, like a cappuccino machine. And then screw on the top. And you put this, see how easy this is? and it looks so realistic, I love it. And so put this on your burner. This one's already made, I think. Is, it, is this one already done, Nikki? Nice and hot? Uh -oh. Yeah. Is this one done? Yeah, the front and the front's done. Oh, okay. Yeah. So this one, just put on here. Just be careful not to get the flame to burn the handle. You can use a little flame tamer on your stove if you have a big burner like we do. So this one is done. Now this is the secret for the perfect, perfect um, uh, cafe latte or, um, and here we go. We're gonna add one cup of milk into a jar. Just you know, one cup. This is um, low fat milk. Very important to get your milk intake every single day. I don't know if you realize that, but doctors say if you get three cups of low fat or no fat milk a day, you will be getting all that wonderful calcium, all the other minerals um, that you need for your body. Now, you know, shake Martha, this. I was just looking on the um, gotmilk.com site, and yeah. um, it says here, this is really interesting, actually. 85% um, of Americans fall short of their uh, daily recommended servings of milk. I'm sure I do. Uh, so do I. I'm I so do. guilty of it, actually. And so I think this recipe is actually kind of a great way to sneak in an well, extra serving. Well, this is serving. eight ounces. So if you're yeah. going to have a nice big cup of, of uh, latte in the morning, this is a very nice way to get that one cup, at least, of your, of your daily requirement. Definitely. Okay, so now don't, you're going to put this into your microwave. How many of you in the audience have a microwave? <laughs> Almost everybody. So put this, now see, it's, it's doubled in bulk. It's gone from eight, eight ounces to 16 ounces because it really does foam up very nicely. Now don't put it in with the top. I was going to uh, tell you all that. We were going to do an experiment and see what happened. I've never, <laughs> not on the show, not live. And we're going to put this into the microwave. <laughs> Nobody instructed me on a microwave. Isn't this horrible? This is our new microwave in our new kitchen. Would you please do this for me? I should have studied our microwave. Oh, okay, enter. There you go. 45 seconds. So, Sean, here's your coffee. You can pour it in at the same time with the milk. And do you like it strong or medium? Um, stout. Stout. That means strong, right? Here you are. Ooh, oh, this looks amazing. Look how good that looks. Looks wonderful. Creamy and Thank delicious. you very much.